Hello everyone, welcome back to my UE team of research. In this video tutorial, I will take you how to make a highlights in your video by using Filmora or person. As you can see here in my video tutorial, it is a highlights color in a circle wise that you can see actually now. So let's get start to do this. First, we need to track your video to the timeline it's simply dragging like this and click on OK and, and now you can see there are a lot of crowd and inside this video so if you really want to highlight someone else inside the video so you need to do a one small step that double click on the videos here and this one you will you will see the motion tracking here so click on that and this time we're gonna move this mark to anyone of the people that you really want to highlight so now we're gonna use this this drag it up like this okay make it smaller and fit to the video and after you have all of these adjust with uh, the image you really want to, to make with so click on start tracking here and wait for the video is in of the tracking line here and after that thing that we're gonna do is click OK and now you will see the mark and uh, some marks point and the head um, green headlight is if you have already doing with that and now we're gonna go to title and add the title here in fact we don't like or don't use the title but that is the way that we're gonna use some uh, effects with this title so now we simply drag it to like this and make sure that you expand your title uh, the same to uh, the with the old lens and then click on the box click on the title here and then go to uh, at once and delete everything just like this so now go to delete the title because we don't want that and this time we're gonna click on add shape here so go ahead and click on add shape and choose this um, square mark here and this time we're gonna add, delete the text also we keep only the shape here and make sure that you have click on that and uh, this time we're gonna change this color to um, to black to make it is black color wheel to black and now we're gonna increase the size for the entire of the video like this and now scrolling up again and make the video to the middle point and then click OK and <coughs> this time we're gonna click on a scale to uh, 300 person to make it a uh, more stronger and then uh, click on add one again and uh, go to shapes again and this time we're going to choose um, the circle it looks like it is black because the background and the title circle is the same color so this time we're going to change the color to white by going to save wheel here and change it to white and <clears throat> this time we're going to click on OK or we we need to adjust the side at, uh, to make something that is more fit to the screen like this in the middle of the screen and this time we can delete some text also so go ahead and click on the next text and now we have two titles here one is the black background and 
Um, the other is the Y circles background shape here. So click on OK. <coughs> and this time we're gonna double click on it again and go to advanced. And this time we're gonna click on the video here. Select on the title here and click on video. And this time we're gonna choose on composting and click on that and then select it to multiply. And now you can see that everything is look like go through inside the circles. But we still not see any other people yet. So our thing that we're gonna do next is to change the capacity of the uh, quality to six T person. It's just a more of that. And then click on OK. And now you can see here and this time we're going to move the um, circle mark to the same to the tracking mode that uh, you really want uh, to do that. And now this time we're going to double click on it again and go to and now we're going to move this away for a while and uh, this time we go to click on the video clip here and this time we go to uh, motion tracking again and uh, this one we're going to ch change uh, the none to default title and then click OK now let's see the result if you want to uh, make some uh, brightness you need to double click on that again and go to videos and you need to change all of this to uh, 50 or just among of that so it now it just can make uh, can see brightness of the people is working now now let's get play or let's check back the video result and you can see uh, everything is look like very fine okay it's working and now i have another video to show you uh, if you want to save this uh, object you need to double click on that and save it as a custom so name it to everything you want to do for example i'm gonna call it cccc and then click ok and the next time we will uh, use it in the transition here or title here and here is uh, the same video that we're going to use with the same uh, effect object that we have already saved a few seconds ago so now if you really want to change and still using the same effect or reuse the same effects you need to do one more step is double click on that and this time we're going to start to tracking of uh, sorry this time we're going to tracking someone else that uh, using for example uh, now i'm going to use i'm going to track with this one here maybe okay and now I'm going to click on start tracking and waiting until it is finished. So, and now, and OK. And now we're going to see it. And this time we're going to add the same title that we have already created. So, and make sure that you have uh, the title length and the video clip is at, uh, at the same length between video and title. And this time we're gonna make this to uh, this one here. I get to this one place here, and the click on the video. The box, click on that, and this time we go to um, post death, and this one we oh sorry go to uh, motion tracking again, and this time we're gonna select. 
the CCC that is the title and now start to see the result what is happening now okay thank you guys for uh, watching my video I hope this tutorial will help you to do uh, with uh, more Fimbra and experience with the Fimbra to make you better of uh, editing any video so thank you for watching